Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Taisha. Today's video, it's a really exciting one and a really good one. If you guys are in a budget, you can still watch this video, but all I'm going to say is this video is going to make you want to go to Marshalls and TJ Maxx and go spend money. It's just the way it is, you guys. Um, so today's video, it's going to be a Marshalls and TJ Maxx haul. I've been seeing a lot of the hashtags on Instagram. If you search TJ Maxx finds, Marshall finds and stuff like that, you see like people's Marshalls and TJ Maxx are so good. Mine here where I do live, it's not that good. You just have to go every week and see what you find. So this is like a collective haul. I did not buy all these things at once Like I said because my Marshalls and TJ Maxx are not that good But if you guys do follow those hashtags or even watch YouTube videos, it's just amazing how many items and things you can find for really inexpensive so today i brought you guys along with me to go shopping so i'm gonna be inserting like a little vlog little section i haven't done a vlog in two years i think the last one i did was when i graduated from high school two years ago that was a long time ago so yeah let me know if you guys enjoy this little like vlog it's not really a vlog but i just brought you guys makeup shopping with me and then if you guys stick around i will be sharing what i got from each store since I found a really amazing stuff. So without further ado, you guys, let's go ahead and go makeup shopping together. Okay guys, we made it to TJ Maxx and then right next door is the Home Goods. Okay, so I'm here with my mom and I'm going straight to the beauty aisle. Okay, so I had to do a voiceover because there was music and I'm not trying to get copyrighted. So, um, at this TJ Maxx, I saw they had a lot of Lorac makeup. So this is, I think it was a liquid lipstick and it was only $5.99. And then I also saw this Smashbox Contour Kit, which I have never tried, but it was only $14.99. And Smashbox actually a good brand and you also get a brush. Um, and then I was looking for more makeup. This is usually where I love looking and you have to really look in there Because sometimes people hide the good stuff like in between the palettes But like I was telling you guys there's more Lorac makeup Those are a lipstick set and it was $9.99 and then you guys thanks for looking at that lip set I was able to find the Stila eye set. It was like really hidden. I'm pretty sure someone was hiding it. It was only $9.99 and you get this beautiful shades. I've been looking everywhere for them. So I make sure I grab my little basket and I had to take it home with me. Um, like I was telling you guys, there's a lot of Lorac, Lorac, however you say it. This was only $9.99. It's a highlighting and blush little set. I never tried this brand so I cannot recommend it. I don't know how it works. But while I kept looking and looking, I found this Kevin Aquan highlighting palette I believe it was. It was $19.99. I don't really am that familiar with this brand, which is why I didn't pick it up. All right, so I also found this Becca Tense Jacqueline Hill little liquid highlighter for $19.99. This is old school, so I was surprised to find that there. And we also found its Marc Jacobs set. Um, it has mascara, liner, and everything for only $19.99. I was really surprised you guys to find this Becca foundation for only $10 but someone had to ruin that for us and it was used. I don't know why people touch makeup literally annoys me so I couldn't pick it up and I also found a Bobbi Brown little blush really affordable as well and it had such a beautiful color but someone had to swatch it which is so annoying. And of course, we had to find some Anastasia lipsticks in TJ Maxx. These were only $7.99. It was such a beautiful color. So now we're going to move on to Home Goods, which is literally one step away from TJ Maxx. So I was ready to do some spring cleaning, like I told you guys. So I needed to find some new makeup organizers, which is why I went to that area. There's so many of them. You guys all need to go and pick them up from there. So after this, we're going to go ahead and head to Marshalls and see what's good there. Okay, guys. So I am at Marshalls. This is the first thing I saw. It's only $4.99 and it looks really nice. And then I also found this thing right here from Pixie which I need. I've been loving Pixie, and it's only $7.99, so I need this. Right here you have all the clearance makeup. There's Too Faced. There's also more Pixie. There's this liner. It's $4.99. Let's see. So there's some more here. There's some more of Pixie. See, there's this eyeshadow right here. $7.99. Looks pretty. There's a lot of palettes here. I don't know which one is good and which one isn't. See, so there's a lip gloss. 
Oh wow. This is the spotlight palette. I think it's from Casey Holmes. And it's $19.99. I also found this lip gloss by Anastasia. It's in the color Sunset Strip. And it's only $7.99, which is not bad at all. And here are the soaps I use every single day. They have all of them. They don't have the one I use, but they do have other ones. They have the green tea one. It's the bigger one. They have a cherry blossom and they retail for $2.99. And they also have the huge one for $14.99. And then if you want to try them all out, they do sell this travel size one for $12.99. Okay guys, so these are the only things I could honestly find that were not open. This Marshall is always dirty. See, compared to the other ones I see online, mine is just not it. It's just not, but I did find this stuff. All right, so I hope you enjoy those clips that I combined for you guys. I'm not the best at vlogging. I also get really shy, which is weird because I'm not a shy person, but I do get shy like talking to a camera in public. That is just... Oh, and I haven't vlogged in two years, so hopefully you guys didn't mind that. Um, so I'm going to be sharing with you guys what I got. I'm going to start with TJ Maxx because I feel like I got the least there, but I got really good things. I'm going to go ahead and get started by talking about the furniture I did get from Home Goods. Um, I don't know if you guys saw my last video, I think it was, or two videos ago. I did mention I wanted to do a spring video, and I got so much positive feedback from that. So, I decided to go to TJ Maxx, E. I found some really good things. So, I found this makeup brush holder right here. Isn't this so cute? I'm thinking about putting it somewhere here. Something about me is that I do not like seeing a lot of makeup out. I like seeing it in a display, but mostly clean. You know how some people have like the really large acrylic boxes everywhere? I do not like that. That would just give me like anxiety. I don't want it. I like seeing everything clean and organized, which right now that's not my life. But I found this really cute brush holder and I like how you can spin it. This was $24.99, which is not that bad, I think, because um, you do get a lot of space and I feel like this will be perfect for all the makeup brushes because this is just not fitting anything anymore and then for inside my little vanity i picked up this one right here this is a clear clearly utility um texture trays that don't slip pretty much just to put your makeup and i'm thinking about putting my everyday makeup here because i have it all in this drawer right here you guys cannot see it but it's a mess so i wanted to be a little bit organized i wish i would have found this like more of these but it was just one left and this was a 9.99 which is not bad at all and i really like it and hopefully this fits. I think it will. Alright guys, so moving on, I also picked up some makeup items and I was honestly super impressed of finding this thing right here. So I've been obsessed with glitter. As you guys can see, I have glitter all over my eyes. In case you guys are wondering, these are the Pixie by Petra Little Glitters in the shade Gold Lava. That's what it looks like right here. Look how beautiful, you guys. Just look how beautiful and shimmery that is. So that's what I have on my eyes. I have this one. Um, this is my first time using it, so I don't know how they will last. But it is super simple. I just grabbed my finger and just packed it in, and I got this much glitter. So I'm wearing that, and I'm also wearing, of course, those of colors frankation palette i really love this palette like this speaks to me i love basic shimmer bronze color that's just me so i was super excited when i found this one's right here this is the stila oh my stars glitter and glow liquid eyeshadow set you guys i finally am gonna be able to try this little sets right here so this was only 9.99 which is super affordable i'm super happy i found this and it was actually hidden i'm pretty sure you guys saw it in the video clips it was among all the makeup palettes all the way in the corner or like in the the bottom i saw it and i was like i have to have it so in this little set right here you do get three of the glitter and glow liquid eyeshadows you get diamond dust kitten karma oh yes i'm so happy and gold goddess and they are mini size but i do believe this retail for 25 dollars in the holiday look how freaking 
cute you guys i am so happy of trying this on so this is the gold goddess this is the kitten karma and i think that's how you say it and then you have your diamond dust i am freaking excited to apply this all over my eyes i feel like this was honestly such a steal to find ten dollars you get three of them you guys what a deal right what a freaking deal and then moving on i also find something i saw on instagram that a lot of people were finding so this is the smashbox camera ready precise blush brush i am excited to try this brush out a lot of people love the smashbox brushes but i'm not about to drop 30 dollars for one makeup brush so this right here was only 9.99 and it was the only one i saw and then i think i saw another one it was a foundation brush but i wasn't gonna use it so i didn't buy it so this is what it looks like right here when it's out of the packaging and it feels like the perfect size for a blush brush or even to contour your skin you can use makeup brushes any way you want so freaking excited i found this i cannot wait to see if i find any more um, i'm pretty much addicted to going to marshall's and tt max now so if you guys have any makeup finds please let me know because i will be going after them and then the last two things are kind of boring stuff but i needed them so i picked up another lip balm i always have to have lip balm especially when i do my makeup every single day going to sleep waking up in the morning i need to have my lips glossy so this is the she moisture coconut and hibiscus lip balm and it's was only 249 i saw coconut and i was like i have to have it anything with coconut i'm gonna have it and i'm also drinking some coconut water right here i'm all over coconut so this one right here i have tried the red packaging one and now i decided to buy this one moving on to marshall's I have it right here i've been to like four different marshall's already and this is how i was able to find all these goodies right here i feel like marshall's i really hit the jackpot so i'm gonna go ahead and get started with the only clothing item i bought and this is such a deal so i found this adidas little track what is it track suit track jacket something like that this is what it looks like right here i love the color it is so pretty it reminds me of daisy and her new palette which i will be reviewing here on my channel so yeah me encanta el color it's like a really pretty mint color and this was only 24.99 you guys if you know about adidas adidas is super expensive and this was 60 dollars right here since it and i picked it up in a size medium and i am so happy to have this i cannot wait to wear it it's like the perfect material for the spring and the color is just scream spring to me i also found some socks from adidas as well this for only 8.99 and i've been needing new socks i'm just kind of like doing a spring clean i want to get all my basics together so i can throw or donating clothes away you know i'm just in that phase right now where i want everything clean everything solid colors and just stuff that i know i'm gonna use and then meanwhile i'm showing you a bunch of makeup that i don't need um, but okay so that's all i got for clothing and now you guys makeup this is where i found a lot of good stuff so again more makeup brushes why i don't know guys i just do not know so this is what they look like right here these are the japanese powder and contour and highlighting brushes so this one right here the bigger one was only 4.99 you see like the prices i cannot say no to such a cheap price and these brushes seem really nice and i have heard good things about them so i picked up the powder brush and then i also picked up the smaller one which looked really good to contour your face with and this one i believe what was this called the contour and highlighting brush and this one was 3.99 again super cheap you guys so this is what this brush looks like out of the packaging Ooh, super soft and it seems really nice i like the handle and i'm glad this was only 3.99 all right the next thing i bought is this lip gloss from mac i am freaking excited i found this this is 7.99 and this is in the color brooklyn born this is part of their alaya collection i think that's how you say her name i always get it confused but this is such a me color it's a really pretty champagne light color i am not wearing lip gloss today you guys i haven't worn a full like matte lip in a while so i decided to keep it pretty natural for today's makeup so yeah guys this color right here looks such a pretty me color and the smell of mac lip glosses Oh, I love it. So we're gonna move on to my last bag. I have it right here and I am so excited for this bag. 
I found so much Pixie Beauty at Marshalls, which I am so happy for, especially since you guys know the glue tonic has literally saved my skin. This is how much product I need to go buy a new one. So while looking in the skincare area, I found this Pixie, what is this called? Skin Treats um, Duo System. This is the best of Rose. I have never tried it and I'm excited to try it. This is only $7.99. Like... $7.99, that is such a good deal. And it comes with a cleanser, a rose tonic, and a rose flash balm. I love Pixie, I love their skincare, and let's see how the rose one works for me. The glow tonic will always be in my skincare, but I wanted to try something different as well. And then I also found this little palette, or not even little, this big palette right here. This was as well $7.99, and this was part of their holiday collection, I believe. So this is the Ultimate Beauty Kid 5th Edition. It has eyeshadows, blushes, and then shimmers in one side. Let me go ahead and open it for you guys. So last time I found this, it was completely used. And then I found it again, and it was new. So you guys just have to go and see a lot of stores. So this is the one side. It comes with a bunch of mattes. And I heard they're really pigmented. I should have used it today, but I completely forgot. And then in the other side, you do get your blush, your bronzers. If that means, oh my god, did I just... Oh, I thought I indented. Oh, I was gonna break my own heart. So it has your blush, highlighters, and I think these are bronzers, or this one at least. I am not sure though. Maybe it's a blush, I don't know. And then you have your shimmers in this side. So let me swatch this color right here. Ooh, it looks pretty. Let me swatch this highlighter. And then, let's see, where's the clean finger? This one right here. They seem really nice. Let me see. So this is one eyeshadow. Oh wow. And then another one. That is pigmented. And then this is the highlighter. This is going to be gorgeous for all the dark skin women and men out there. Beautiful, you guys. And then I also, this is what I was talking about. I found the Stila Liquid Eyeshadow Shimmer and Glow. This is the first time I went to Marshalls. This was only $7.99. And this is in the shade Vivid Smoky Quartz. Quartz, quartz, quartz. I cannot say it. Um, but this is a really pretty bronzy color. That's what it looks like. And I am obsessed with it as well. This is going to be perfect for those summer nights. If you want like a bronze smoky eye. That's what it looks like right there. It's super pigmented. I might as well swatch for you guys the other ones as well that I found on TJ Maxx. You guys can see them better. So this one right here. It's the gold one. I am obsessed. And then this one is the diamond one. I like how they're mini too because honestly I have so much makeup that I don't really run out of stuff quickly since I can always, I'm, I feel like I'm always trying something new every week. And then this is the kitten one. Do you guys see how reflective these are? I'm telling you, if you find this at your local TJ Maxx or Marshalls, please pick them up. And then the last thing I bought is something you guys already know. I'm seriously obsessed. I'm such a believer of this product. This is the Anti-Cellulite Body Wash. And this is in the color... In the color? Oh my god. This is in the scent Wild Flowers. I usually use the lavender one, but this is freaking bomb. Um, this is my third one already. It was only $4.99. I feel like it... Of course, you cannot get rid of cellulite just like this, but it does make them really smooth. And if you have any dark marks in your body, it's just going to line them up as well. So I'm excited I found this. And again, it was only $4.99. I think at Ulta, they're $7. So if you find it, definitely pick it up and let me know how you guys feel about it. Because I am seriously obsessed with the sponges. I cannot go without them. I'm probably going to keep buying them for the rest of my life because they're that good. Alright guys, so that's pretty much all I have for today's video. I told you this video was going to make you go and want to shop. I told you, I warned you. Let me know in the comments below what you guys are going to go and try and find at your local Marshalls or TJ Maxx. Because I already know I'm going to go probably later today and try and find more items. I just have to stay away from that freaking hashtag, but I just cannot. I can, literally cannot. And also, I wanted to mention that TJ Maxx and Marshalls are really good as well to buy snacks from. I would show you guys the snacks, but I ate them already. I'm the type of person that eats them in the car, eats them right when they get home. I cannot 
for the life of me make a bag of like chips and stuff last i don't really like chips i usually buy the hazelnut waffles i think that's what they're called if i can find it i'll have a picture right here if i cannot then i couldn't but they're super good and i literally eat them in like an hour they are gone it's just the way it goes so yeah guys i hope you all have an amazing weekend like i said everything that i'm wearing even a hair tutorial will be included in the description box below so make sure you guys check it out now i'm gonna go ahead and try and edit this video by today and i will see you guys very very soon with a new video bye guys